Hello, welcome, and thanks for checking out Black Ice Mod Advanced. With the recent public release of version 3.4, we've decided to create a handful of tutorial videos to help you get started exploring some of the new features available in FPS Creator. So let's jump in. Start by going to our website at blackicemod.org. This is how you'll download and keep up to date with all things BIMA. I'm already a part of the Discord, so it'll drop me right in, but you'll need to click to accept the invitation to join. After you're done saying hi in the chat and you're ready to download, scroll down to the left until you get to the header that says BIM Advanced. Then click the tab that says Hashtag Releases. Down at the bottom, we see a change log for the newest public release, again version 3.4, and above that is a username and password to log into the Black Ice Mod Launcher. Let's continue by clicking the drive link, then download, and then download one more time. Black Ice Mod Advance will start downloading. Now that we're done downloading, go ahead and click the EXE to start the installation. Windows will give us a pop-up. Click Run anyway. Go ahead and click Next as we make our way through the installer. It's important to read the terms and conditions especially if you intend to release any commercial games with BIMA. Now the installer will start loading files. Once BIMA is successfully installed, ensure you have NVIDIA PhysX installed. BIMA uses NVIDIA PhysX as its primary physics engine, rather than the original engine that came with FPS Creator. It's optional, but I highly recommend you install it. Be sure to tick the box if you don't already have DirectX 9 installed. In my case, I'm going to leave it unchecked. You're going to see a pop-up. You can hit the N key to exit. It's an older file cleaner tool for FPSC, but it's antiquated today. Now there are a handful of useful tools that come pre-installed with BIMA to help the older FPSC engine under the hood do some extra cleaning and maintenance. It's important to run these tools during every session in BIMA to ensure minimal bugs and errors when compiling your levels. First, ensure that all executables in your BIMA folder are set to Run as Administrator. You can do this by right-clicking on each EXE and going to the Compatibility tab and checking the box accordingly. Ensure this is done for every EXE in your root FPSC folder. Another important tool is fpsccleaner.exe. When you open this program, it'll pop up in your Windows hotbar, activated by hitting the Win plus B keys while running FPSC. This cleans out any dark basic object in bin files that FPSC creates while testing levels, bloat files that lead to corruption over time and need to be dealt with. The other tool to be aware of is the dump memory tool, which should be opened while BIMA is running. This tool is less important to use today due to changes made to how BIMA dumps memory on its own, but it's always good to know that it's here for a fresh reset on FPSC's memory count. Now that we're ready to start, let's double click the BIMA launcher. Before we start the engine, we'll want to activate our login. Go back to Discord for a moment and copy paste the username and password into their respective spots. You are now ready to start creating your very own levels and games using Black Ice Mod Advanced. More tutorials to come, and thanks for checking out.